Hey guys, it's Toza and welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are all doing well. If you guys haven't subscribed yet, make sure you guys hit that subscribe button and join the family and also check out my social media accounts on Instagram, Snapchat and Twitter. It's just Teresa Trends. <laughs> And I also wanted to say a big thank you for 18k subscribers. I can't believe 18,000 people have hit that subscribe button. That's honestly insane. And I just wanted to say a big thank you. And thank you so much for your endless support. And for everyone who has been subscribed since like day one or like since like 1k subscribers. Or even if you just subscribed yesterday or today, um, it means the world to me. So by the title of this video, you guys know that it's going to be the prep and pack with me for Hawaii. It's currently Monday and I fly out on Wednesday afternoon like holy shit I'm going in a few days and I swear to god I've been mentioning Hawaii in every single video you guys are probably sick of it but stay tuned for the Hawaii vlogs have my eyelash appointment in 30 minutes I'm so excited to get some eyelashes on I got some parcels as well to open I got something from Shopo I think this is from Aceology, so like face mask and then I have a goodness box. I got this last month as well So I'm really excited to see what they have in this month's box But I'll probably open it um, once I come back from my eyelash appointment because I need to eat I got my peanut butter. I feel like this is not going to be filling at all I normally like to have savory for breakfast. This is honestly my favorite peanut butter ever. It's like the Mavis peanut butter I'm gonna add some chia seeds I got some green tea as well. I feel like I had a really long weekend this weekend. Like, I didn't really do anything, but it felt so long. Like Before I head out, I want to quickly show you guys what I got. So I got like these waterproof pouch casing. I got it from eBay and I feel like it would just be so handy in Hawaii. I've already tested it out and water doesn't go in. I put like spoons in there. And I put it under water for like, I think a few hours and no water went in. So I'm going to use this for Hawaii. The girls got some as well. So this is the packaging and the brand is Empower. I think we got it for like, I think it was um, just under $20 or just over $20. So we also got some travel sims as well before we got to Hawaii because I did research and I was asking around. A lot of people said that it's so expensive over there. So we decided to just buy our own online. I think it's like a six or seven day SIM card thing and it's like unlimited data. I kid you not, my car is so freaking dirty. Like I was meant to clean it on the weekend, but cleaning my car is honestly the one thing I hate doing the most. I honestly hate cleaning my car. I kind of remember the last time I cleaned my car to be honest. Where's my lip balm? My lips are so dry. I just woke up my sister and I told her I was getting my lashes on. And I asked if she wanted to go get food after. So we'll see what time I finish getting my lashes done. This is a before shot of my non-existent lashes. And I'll talk to you guys soon once my lashes are on. It's currently 1.40 and I just got home. I got my eyelashes on. I finally have eyelashes now. They're a lot darker and more dramatic compared to the ones I got in Japan. I got my eyelashes done by Mary at the Eyelash Aesthetics. I'll leave her Instagram right here. She's currently having a 20% off promotion for like students as well. So definitely check her out and give her a follow. And thank you so much again, Mary, for my lashes, getting me Hawaii ready. I'm heading out soon with my sister. We're just going to go get some food. I'm actually so hungry. It's already 2 p.m. And all I had today was those two little crumpets. We're probably going to go get cafe food. Craving an acai bowl. Also craving, like, chicken schnitzel salad. I'm honestly so freaking hungry. Like, towards the end of my um, eyelash appointment, my stomach was, like, rumbling. And I actually fell asleep at the beginning as well. This is a close-up of my lashes, guys. They're so fluffy. I just came back from grocery shopping. And look at all that. Holy very, crap. Very, very hungry. What are you making tonight? Uh, beef noodle Why are you swaying? What would you buy this for? This is so oh, cute. Oh, my fancy in hospital. Oh, this is honestly so cute though. We're at Vine and Grind. So excited to eat. She comes to eat with me and gets tea. <laughs> Where is your lunch? Peppermint tea. It looks like this. <laughs> we got some sweet potato fries. I've honestly been craving this for so long. Chicken halloumi salad. That is freaking massive. But so yummy. I'm back home and I don't know why, but I'm so freaking tired. I ended up getting some baby shampoo from um, Woolies just to clean my eyelashes. I want to open up some parcels now. Why am I so tired? Like, I'm literally due for now. Ooh. Oh my god, the packaging is so cute. I love this whole reflection thing. Thank you, Aceology, for sending this face mask out just in time for my... Hawaii trip. Ooh. 
Wow, these are like massive. So this is the hydrating, soothing and replenishing face mask. Can't wait to try that one out. I got two dresses from Shopo as well. This is the first dress I got. I was like contemplating like what size I should get, but I got both in size small. So it's like a size 8. Okay, looking at the dress now, if I got any smaller, it would have been way too tight. Pretty sure it is stretchy as well. Oh my god, it's not stretchy. How am I going to fit into this? No, there has to be a zip. No way can I slip into this. This is the other dress I got. Looks like it will fit me better. But definitely have to try it on. Oh my god, this box feels so heavy. If you guys want to grab your own goodness me box, I do have a discount code. It's just Teresa10 all in caps locks. And you guys can get 10% off your box. They give you like a card and it tells you like everything that's in it. Ooh, this box looks so colorful and so cute. White sugar replacement. So some sweetener. Veggie two minute noodles. We also have a little chocolate thing as well. Yum. We have some ginger lemon sparkling water. I'm actually not a huge fan of sparkling water. But I feel like um, if it's like flavored sparkling water, it might taste a bit better. We have some dairy free orange chocolate milk is this milk i'm not too sure we have a protein bar yum bay juice 100 korean pear juice fruit and vegetable cleaning wash i've never heard of this before some red curry paste why do i always make the biggest mess oh my god i also grabbed these two things for hawaii as well so i just have like face wipes so i can like use it on the plane and just like something easy to take off my makeup and also got some body lotion. I'm trying on the dresses and not gonna lie, this was so hard to slip into. This dress doesn't have a zip anyway, so I literally had to squeeze into it. But it actually looks pretty cute. It's just like a plain black dress, but then the material is sort of... I don't know how to explain that. But it's like glittery, but it's like a pretty good length as well. And it doesn't ride up because it hugs pretty nicely. Okay, this is the mustard dress. Mum made the biggest part of... Yeah, the boy. Oh my god, where are you from? Yummy. I am so excited to eat this. <laughs> Good morning, you guys. It's currently 11 a.m. and I am starting to pack. Well, I haven't really pulled out my suitcase yet, but I started to organize my makeup. My skincare, everything is chucked on my table. Also with my lashes, I woke up this morning and I was looking in the mirror and I was really trying to get used to them. But I feel like they're just too dramatic for like my eye shape. So I messaged uh, Mary, the girl that does my lashes, and she said she's going to take a few off for me later tonight just so I can look a bit more natural. Like I do love them, like they're so freaking fluffy. I just feel like it doesn't really suit my eye shape. So I'm going to go back there tonight around like 8.20 to remove a few so it looks a bit more natural. So I pretty much sorted out all my makeup. I'm just going to be bringing this, not bringing like any eyeshadow or like eyeliner because I have like my lashes on. And then we have a few toiletries, a few scrunchies and then I have some like skincare things here. Got my makeup bags and I also have this book as well which I got um, on the way back from Bali. And I didn't really finish reading it or anything, so maybe I'll bring this and maybe I'll read it on the plane. Who knows? Got my suitcase. Oh my god, look how dusty it is. Oh, that's so gross. I definitely need to wipe that down. This is what we're currently working with. I got out my swimwear, so I'm pretty much going to bring... Wait, what is this? No, this is gym tights. Not that. This is pretty much all um, swimwear. I think I'm going to bring all of them. I do usually only wear like the mustard one and the khaki one. These two are pretty much my go-to um, bikinis. But I want to bring these ones as well because I feel like we're pretty much going to be living in swimwear. Because probably like where we go hiking, I'm probably going to wear like a swimwear top. And then I also have gym clothes as well. I have these right away ones. I have like these cotton on ones as well. This one, I have like two black ones, so I'm probably gonna sack this one because we don't need two of the same color. And then I have these right away sport bras, so just this purple one, white one, nude one. This is sports bra slash swimwear, so I'm probably gonna bring this as well. So I think I wanna stick to these four. And then I think I wanna bring two pairs of tights, or I might wear one pair of tights on the plane. That's what I'm thinking of doing. Now I wanna get started with the actual clothing. Which I feel like might be a bit harder. Quick update. I pretty much just chucked everything on my bed that I think I would wear to Hawaii. So I got like short skirts 
And then a whole heap of tops as well. I feel like this is like way too many things. So I'm just going to sort it out and pick out like outfits and stuff. But let me quickly show you guys these pants. It's from Beginning Boutique. And I haven't worn it yet because I feel like it's such a beachy type of pants. And it's sort of see-through as well. So I feel like it's okay if you wear like swimmers underneath. The weather is amazing. Oh my god, my lens is like so dusty i'm heading out to go get food now i want to pick up tamira and then we're just going to go to a cafe the weather is so hot like i am loving it and it's making me so excited for hawaii i haven't had anything to eat all day i didn't eat breakfast yet so lunch is going to be my first meal probably going to eat come home i sort of want to go gym today as well so i might go gym in the morning and then come home and finish packing but yeah, I don't know. We'll see how I go with time. Oh my gosh, she looks so cute. I look like a freaking potato. Hello. You look so cute. Got my coffee fit. Tam got an acai. Sorry, I was going to say acai bowl. Acai smoothie. I got an egg benedict. What is new? I always stick to the same stuff because I know I'm going to love it. Tam got an egg benedict as well. But with a croissant. Ooh. I just got back from breakfast, such a good catch up with Tamira And I quickly just got changed into some gym clothes I'm going to head to the gym now My last gym session until Hawaii And my room is still pretty much a mess But I'll do that a bit later This sports bra is from Running Bear I'm wearing my leggings from right away And just my Nike shoes I literally had the worst workout ever It's currently 3.30 I don't even think I trained for an hour. I don't know why, but I'm so tired. I literally feel like I can't breathe. I was just so tired. I had no motivation and I was literally like struggling to breathe, which was making it really hard to like work out. So I decided to just call it and I listened to my body because clearly my body was telling me to not work out. But I am glad I got myself to the gym. I did like a few exercises, so that's fine. But anyways, got my protein here. My room is so freaking messy. Like I walk in and there is stuff everywhere but my parcels came i can't even remember what i got oh yeah i got a sports bra and i got some tights let me show you guys oh what i got these seamless leggings i have this in black and i freaking love it so much it's like the bum scrunch thing maybe i'll bring this one to hawaii because it matches with my sports bra how cute would that be i also got this black sports bra as well it's like charcoal gray and this one goes with these tights i love wearing like matching sets i feel like it just looks super cute and i got this um gym bag got it for my boyfriend but might bring it to hawaii let me have a look at it oh my god it's actually so freaking big what material is this it's like so soft let me open this up wow this is humongous i feel like it's such a cute travel bag but this would definitely be way too big for me at the gym. I feel like my boyfriend wouldn't use this at the gym because he's currently using like a duffel bag like this. I just got home. It is currently 10.30 and um, your girl still has not packed. Hi. My sister's here. I still have not packed but update. I got like my skincare and all that and makeup into makeup bags. I have like so many freaking makeup bags like one two three four five six but it's just like toiletries and like there's toiletries makeup skincare I always have the trouble of like remembering what's in what but I'm just gonna deal with that once I get to the hotel my clothes are sorted so I got my PJs undies socks um, I just have this one dress and then I have like a whole heap of tops. I feel like I'm overpacking because I feel like we're just going to be living in swimwear. But we have the tops, the bottoms. I have like a lot of bottoms. Like, do I really need three denim and three white? Like, not. I think there's like four white. Oh my god. Oh my god. For the airport, I'm going to be wearing these ASIC shorts. And just my champion t-shirt. I don't know if I should bring a jacket. I feel like I might because it might be cold in the airplane but just gonna be wearing that what is that is that a stain what is that wait is that my shadow or a stain <gasps> what the hell is that i also got my eyelash thinned as well why well, i got a few removed thank you so much mary for doing it so last minute for me but i honestly love getting my lashes on because i just sit there and we just like chit chat it literally felt like we were having a sleepover these are my lashes they're a lot more thinner and natural which i freaking love i just feel like the other set was a bit too dramatic with like without makeup on but i am feeling these lashes i want to start putting things in the suitcase i'm actually not bringing the um beach towels because 
Angela caught up and said the hotel actually gives us beach towels. So not gonna bring towels, but let's pack everything else in there. Can't forget the waterproof pouch things for our phones. So mine's already open, but I'm just gonna I guess I'm just gonna shove it there because it doesn't really matter where it sits. My suitcase is actually so messy. Like I know those people who travel and everything is so neat and organized but I'm just not one of those but it's fine. It all fits anyway. This is in my carry-on so I have a pen. Always need that. I've got my glasses because your girl's a blind bitch. Got my wallet. I normally don't use this wallet, but I just use it to travel because I need like someone to put my money. I also have this passport. My boyfriend actually got me this freaking cute ass passport holder when he went overseas. It's honestly the cutest thing ever. I honestly love having like personalized items. And then have my two portable chargers. Do I really need two? I don't know, but just in case. And then in here, I just have my toiletries. I did chuck a few more items into my luggage, but I'm gonna zip it up and weigh it and see how much it weighs. I'm also gonna bring these two snacks for the plane as well. So this is just like a protein bar. And this is just like a cup of noodles, which I'm gonna bring. And I'm also bringing this cardigan as well on the plane, just in case it gets a bit cold. That's it for today's video. I really hope you guys enjoyed packing and prepping with me for Hawaii. Make sure you guys stay tuned. For the vlogs, I'm not too sure how many vlogs I'm going to do, but I'm definitely going to have at least one vlog. If you guys haven't subscribed yet, make sure you guys hit that subscribe button and join the family. And also check out my social media accounts on like Instagram, Snapchat, and Twitter. And I will see you guys very, very soon in the Hawaii vlog. Bye, guys. Oh,